Hello YouTube, it's me, it's your iPhone Captain. Today we're going to be discussing the new iPad Air that's going to be releasing on November 1st. So let's go ahead and discuss some of the specs that have been released. Uh, first of all, it's going to be available in space gray or silver and it's going to weigh only one pound, guys. Can you believe that? That's unreal. Compared to the iPad 4, which weighs 23 ounces, that's roughly about a pound and a half. So you're talking about 8 ounces trimmed off of a full size device. We're not talking about the mini now, we're talking about the iPad Air. And it's going to be 6.6 .6 by 9.4 inches in size with retina display. It has an A7 chip processor with 64-bit architecture and an M7 motion compressor or co-processor co co I should say. Now it's going to be available in Wi-Fi and cellular of course. The Wi-Fi version is going to start at $499 for a 16 gigabyte and the cellular version will start at $629 for six for sixteen gigabyte, it's going to have a one point two megapixel front facing camera, which is capable of taking seven twenty HD video. The rear facing camera is going to be five megapixels with the ability to take ten eighty p video. So pretty good difference there. And another awesome thing they've upgraded is battery life. You're going to be able to get up to ten hours of battery life on the iPad Air. Uh, the other things that they did, they did add some free apps from Apple. You're going to be able to get all the iLife such as iMovie, iPhoto, GarageBand, and you're going to be getting pages, numbers, keynotes, podcasts, find my iPhone which was already free. But pages was like 10 bucks numbers was and keynote if i'm not mistaken those were all like 10 bucks a piece so iMovie i know was 4.99 it's going to save you a lot of money this is guys in the box with the ipad air you're going to get the ipad air along with the lightning to usb cable and a usb power adapter that plugs into the wall so that's pretty much it guys um for the ipad air the iPad Mini now is going to weigh 0.69 pounds, guys. That's only like a little over a half a pound. And it's going to start at $299 for the non-retina display, which is the one that's available right now. And the non-retina display version has an A5 processor. The retina display version is going to have an A7 processor. And it's going to start at 429 for the 16 gigabyte. So that's a pretty big difference there in power and speed. They're saying the A7 processor is eight times faster than the original iPad. And along with this uh, iPad Mini Retina, it's going to be coming with iOS 7, and you're going to get all the free apps that I mentioned previously that's coming on the iPad Air along with the uh, lightning connector on the on the iPad retina display. So that's pretty much all of it in a nutshell guys. Hope these specs helped. Don't forget before you leave hit that subscribe button. It's right down there before you leave. It really helps me out. Keep coming back.